Hi, welcome back to my channel. This is Dr. Uchenna Ilo. In this video, I want to talk about um, why we need to do the work, uh, why it's necessary for us to just keep doing the work. Um, now, this the, um, this message is for uh, anybody that's you know struggling, starting, trying to start a business, or, or trying to recover from uh, past tragedy, or just on uh, you know creative people, artists. Um, people that have to motivate or inspire themselves to do the work. Um, these are the people I'm talking to, uh, the freelancers, um, the innovators, etc. And yeah, it's difficult to get up in the morning, you know, and be inspired to do your work. Um, so we need to find work, you know, that gives, that has a purpose for us. We need to find um, work that inspires us intrinsically. Um, that fires us up to go and do something. Uh, doesn't have to fire you every single time, but um, but you know, you feel that you're missing out on something if you're not doing that work. Um, that's the work that we call a calling. Uh, so your work should be your calling. Your work should be your art. Your work should be your play. And it's really essential that we know that we have to do this work by ourselves uh, because nobody's coming to do it for us. Um, the impact that you want to make, uh, nobody's going to come and make it for you. You have to do it by yourself. You just have to do the work. Um, sometimes it's painful. It's, it feels a little bit painful, but you know, without pain, we don't know that we're alive. And if the work that you're doing doesn't scare you um, or doesn't deter you, uh, you know, then you're not really doing something very big. You're not going outside of your comfort zone. You're probably still in your comfort zone. Now, that's the paradox that I, I always talk about. Your work has to scare you. And at the same time, you need to be inspired to do that work despite the fear. Now, this is where the clash is. This is where the tension is. You know you have to do something um, you know, to, to further yourself or to reach a particular goal that you have for yourself um, or to make a particular contribution you have to make. But at the same time, you, that goal, what you need to do scares you because you're afraid of failure. Um, so there are two things here weighing on your mind. The fear of failure and um, the regret of, uh, of not doing what you know you could do. Uh, so with experience, we know that we just have to take that pain and do that work. Um, do work that matters. Um, it's interesting that when, when, when you want to do work that really matters, work that's important, um, that's where procrastination comes in. That's where fear comes in. That's where doubt comes in. Um, that's where postponing things come in. Um, but when we are doing things that do not really matter, for example, wasting time on social media and um, scrolling through people's pictures and all that, uh, then we're not really so. We're, we're not. Um, nothing stops us from doing that. Like we're we're happy doing it, um, making comments on people's posts on Facebook or whatever. Uh, on, on social media, you know, these things give us uh, <laughs> some kind of, I mean, they're easy to do, uh, there's no blockade there, there's no barrier, um, because it's just basically time wasting. Um, but when you, have, when you have to do something that's important, something that really matters, um, you notice resistance coming from everywhere from within you, stopping you from doing it, um, making you feel afraid of doing it and putting it out there. Uh, that is where we need to fight, um, where we need to fight the resistance. Um, yeah, so that's how it works. My message for today is, is simple and it's very short, you know, do the work, um, plan the work. You won't do it well if you don't plan it. Uh, planning is not that difficult. It just means that you should break down the work um, into manageable steps. Uh, well, into logical steps, first of all, you know, of how you're going to achieve it. If you want to write an article or something, you can have the different sections and start filling it up day by day, you know, little by little, sentence by sentence, paragraph by paragraph. Um, yeah, that's what I mean by planning, breaking it down into steps. That's the meaning of strategy. Into steps that will lead you to the final um, 
destination. Uh, so I'm just here to encourage you to please do the work, whatever work you've been postponing. Um, if you have been waiting for all co for conditions to be perfect before you start, please don't start, don't wait. Um, just do the work, and you will be grateful that you started. Thank you, and I'll see you guys again on another video.